Hey everybody, Jem Schofield here with the C47 and another episode of Gearbox. I'm here today. Gearbox, I'm excited to be on the show. I'm so excited to have you. This is Hans and he is from... Europe. And we've known each other for a long time seven now. Seven years. Seven years. Nine years? I was... No, seven. I've been thinking of that. I was thinking this morning, only this morning. I mean, I thought of it other times, but recently it was this morning was yeah. thinking of that was prague yeah summer of uh 2001 so it when was nine met. years when we met it was nine years yeah you're right i'm wrong what can i say happens but nine years ago you were traveling uh on a gypsy caravan teaching camera technique to the children of europe if that's what you told us Making your way, picking well, up not change, exactly. I and think you I... came upon us, our buddy cookie stand, there outside of an apple factory. You're cooking stories up again, just like you used to. I like to cook them up. We've, we've known each other for a long time now. And 19 done a lot years, of stuff. 19 years. Or nine. Nine and plus still. 10 is 19. <laughs> and that's why we used to work a porter gym inside an apple factory with apples rolling all around here and there upon the ground everywhere you chose to look yeah. apples falling into books apples above your head in the sky apples falling on you and i apples apples everywhere and not a drop of cider to drink because they didn't make cider you understand yeah but there was a man an italian filmmaker who shall remain nameless because he yeah. was he had scruples he didn't have so many scruples had some rubles, but no scruples. You understand? I do. And not so much. And he was storing a, you call it a porter jib. A porter jib, yep. In this apple factory. Well, what do you call it? Super boom or a uber boom. Did you call Depending it that on how when, close you are to the German When border. we were doing this, were you calling it a uber boom? Uber boom. We would say, Jam, be careful. The uber boom will hit you. Oh, yeah. And you would say, I'm not going to operate that. I'm going to tell you how to operate that. That's true. <clears throat> And so we did, and we became quite expert at moving up, moving down, pushing, pulling, this kind of thing. Yeah, so just to set it up, I mean, this was a, a huge apple factory in northern... Prague. In the northern regions. Or Italy, which is well, really north, where northeastern section of the western area of southern Europe, and uh, near the border of Czechoslovakia yeah. and Italy, where they almost come together with Greece is very close at hand. And if you dip your foot into the Mediterranean, as a famous poet said, soon you'll swim the Hellespont. It doesn't matter. Mm. That summer, we were focused on apples, the apple factory, and a boom that we like to call Susie. But sometimes we call it just Puerto Jeep. Yeah. And sometimes he would say, make her sing, Susie. <laughs> make her sing. And that was, I mean, that was really... That was, 19, that was, year, that was 19 years ago today. Or nine. Or nine. Between the two. <laughs> you know, sometimes you yeah, cry silly man. It's, I have not watched this show. Are all of these episodes this silly? So really what I wanted to do was just introduce you to Hans because he's going to be here for, he says, a short remember, while. But this, this is, remember, in filmmaking technique, when we say push, you do that. When we say pull, you do that. When we say pan left, understand, you pan like that. When we say pan right, and you pan like that because you understand camera direction is reversed from screen direction. Right. Right? Yeah. That's what you taught me anyway. It's true. And so now I'm here. And so we're going to be joining together forces. Yep. And making some uh, films together. Of Maybe you'll various do some more, length and duration. You might do some more gearboxes. Love to do more gearboxes. Maybe ones that make a little more sense than this one. Mm. And are you being critical of me? No, no, no. I'm listening to you. And we will uh, try to teach and inform. That's why we're here. We want to share. Share, baby, share. Like my old mother used to say to me. When you find yourself way over there, all you can do is share, baby, share. She spoke in riddles. Was confusing sometimes, depending on what language she was speaking. But she made a lot of sense. Okay. Right? That works for me. Did your mother speak in that fashion? No, but... But she made a lot of sense. 
You can tell, look at you. You're so clean cut. Quite a sick beard, by the way. Sick. Sick is my accent. You're making fun of my accent? No, no, no. Sick as in what? what do you sick, mean? sick, like a book. Oh, thick. Sick, yes. Yeah, yeah, what I it. said. Okay, yes. What a nice <laughs> guy. Make me feel so welcome. Stop it. Come on. Sure. No, no Hans and I are very close. Later, we're going to make cornbread together with little chocolate bits sprinkled around the top. I think that's about it. Oh, somebody's here. Somebody's here. We have to get out of this space. We uh, want to thank you for coming to Gearbox. And so until next time, I'll until see you on... Until next time. Gearbox. Auf Wiedersehen. Tut allure. Take it easy. Thanks, Hans. Sure. We'll, we'll talk soon.